morning. Okay, I am having the best bait day. This is like bait number 12, I think. So, really, really good. All right, I caught like 14 bait, which is 12 more than I usually catch lately. Uh, so I'm in, sitting in a really good position. I have two lines out. One of them has my camera. I have this new camera that you put on the line and you can see when the fish actually strikes. So, so I'm hoping I can maybe get a bite on this and see when the fish actually comes in and goes for the grab. Come on! Small shibi, probably like 10 pound, uh, 12, maybe 15. Little guy. All right, small yellowfin tuna, small shibi. everyone uh, welcome to my garage the video is not done yet I have two more bonus clips that I want to show you guys the first one is kind of an announcement I'm gonna start diving again um, I used to dive a lot before I started making videos but I have all the gear now for doing blue water dives from the kayak so still looking for those same fish uh, for Ono, Mahi Mahi and Ahi Shibi um, I'm still pretty new at it as far as blue water goes so it might take me a while to actually catch something I'm not gonna post a video unless I do catch something um, but this has been a little clip of my first attempt at trying to catch a pelagic fish from the kayak I'm doing spearfishing. So stay tuned for that. So for the second clip, it's actually a clip from a couple weeks ago. I went out with Shay and our friend Jason, um, and I got a bite from a mahi mahi. <laughs> yep. 
The only problem was I was close to this scientific instrument device that the state has been using to record um, ocean conditions and the mahi-mahi just swam straight for it and got wrapped up and it broke off. The clip wasn't long enough to make a video and I didn't actually catch anything so I'm just going to include it here. You can kind of see the um, the wave rider thing is actually really cool to look at if you look at it's a solar panel wave powered board basically it looks like a surfboard and it attracts life out there just because there's nothing else around so this clip shows what happened that day and how i lost a pretty good sized mahi it was probably in the high teens low 20s so i was pretty bummed about that bro i am so sad right now so thanks for watching my video i hope you guys enjoyed it and stay tuned for the next one